Man, that was such an intense game. <sighs> Patriots fans telling me all week we didn't have a chance to beat them. 22-21 Dolphins. Good game, Patriots fans. Good show. Alright, guys, there's a battle with uh, best Pokemon fan ever, and this is actually a rematch of my um, mixed tournament battle. The first one wasn't really YouTube fit. I got a 6-0 sweep with Manaphy, but um, this one is hopefully a little better. So I go, I lead with my Claydol, he leads with Executor, he goes for the Sleep Powder right off the bat. Um, and here he overpredicts me completely because I tried to do the same move twice and go into Scissor, but he you know, predicts it this time, because he goes out in a hand doom. Um, that's one of the disadvantages I face when I go into rematches, because my opponent overpredicts me a lot, because they know my team. But, um, anyway, so I go into Kecleon, which is Jimmy's Kecleon, and he gets critted! Man, Jimmy, ah, your Pokemon are just so unlucky. But, um, yeah, so he gets critted, and then the Hound Dude's able to take me out. But now I go in a Hound, or Manaphy, and I set up the Tail Glow. I got the sweep with Manaphy last game, um because he switched out with Houndoom instead of attacking me, but this time he goes for the Dark Pulse. But I'm just going to go for the Surf after I get the Tail Glow, and this is a max speed Manaphy, so I I know I can outrun most of his team, as I recall. Um, and he goes out into Executor, which I know I can outrun, but last time I already broke his Focus Sash. This time um, he actually has a Focus Sash, which makes me kind of sad, because I hit it down to one health. He's going to go for the Sunny Day, um, and because Executor has... Um, chlorophyll, it's now faster than my Manaphy. I have to switch out, fearing the Solar Beam, so I go out into Scizor, um, and this is my bulky Swords Dance Scizor, who takes the Solar Beam amazingly, and that doesn't do squat. So, I don't really know what he's going to do, so I decide to just, um, go for the Swords Dance, but then I remember he has Salamence. Um... I completely forgot he had a Salamence, so uh, that Swords Dance was completely pointless because I have to switch, can't stay in, don't have Stealth Rock set up this game, so uh, I have to switch. So I go out into Claydol, hoping that I'll wake up maybe and uh, be able to set up Stealth Rocks. He goes for the Fire Blast, it missed, which was kind of big because Fire Blast is being boosted by Sunny Day at the moment. He hits the second one, um, and... Uh, it does a lot of damage, and I don't wake up, unfortunately, for me, so he is going to be able to finish me off with another Fire Blast, and that sucks. Um, I really didn't have anything else. I wanted to die to the Salamence. Claydol was really the only thing I could afford to um, lose. So now I go out into Manaphy. I already know from last game I'm faster than this Mence, so I'm just going to go for the Ice Beam and try to kill it. He goes out into his Executor as Death Fodder. So um, Executor goes down, and now he's going to go out into his own Scizor, which is, of course, going to try to bullet punch me. And this is a Choice Band Scizor, so I go out into my own Scizor um, to resist the bullet punch, and he does that pretty nicely. And I know I can... Um, I'm just going to go for the bullet punch this time, uh, figuring he'll go into Salamence, and I'll have to switch anyway. Um, so I just want to get as much damage as I can, and I just go for the bullet punch. does pretty decent damage to Salamence, um, enough that... It's significant because he's life orb, so he has a limited amount of times he can actually, you know, uh, attack me. So I go out of Rhyperia to res resist the uh, Fire Blast, um, and because Rhyperia doesn't have great special defense, the Fire Blast still does a lot of damage. He's going to kill me with Draco Meteor. I pretty much sent out uh, Rhyperia's Death Fodder. Um, and to lower special attack. So now I can go out into Scizor, just go for the Bullet Punch, because I know I can kill it without the Intimidate at this point. So I go for the Bullet Punch, and that does take out a Salamence, which is pretty nice. Anyway, so my Scizor is looking pretty nice right now. So he goes out into Melotic, um, and I decide to switch out into Gallade, uh, pretty much, because I was kind of fearing the Hypnosis. I didn't know if he had it or not. But he just goes for the Surf. Gallade takes out pretty nicely, due to, be, to his pretty good special defense. I want to go for the Close Combat, because this is my Choice Band Galad. I actually expected to kill it, but he lived. Melotic is ridiculously bulky. Um, and he sets up a Toxic on my Gallade. Um, and that's not too bad, uh, because it's a Choice Band Glade. I was, I was actually fearing that he'd go Surf again, and after the special defense drop of Close Combat, that would be a big problem. But I just go for the Close Combat again, why not? He goes out into Grumpig to resist me, but Grumpig's defenses are pitiful, so I kill him in one hit, despite the resistance, um, and that's really epic for me, and I know all he has left is Scizor and, um, Melotic. I go for the Close Combat, figuring he might uh, tried to not lock himself into Bullet Punch, knowing I have Scizor. Really, I won no matter what. If he went uh, Bullet Punch there, I would have went into Scizor um, and set up a Swords Dance, and then it would have been a sweep. So, either way, I really have that in the bags. But, uh, good game. Rate, comment, subscribe, guys, and um, hope to see you guys next time. Alright, Choice Band, Gallade is a beast!
Alright, so make sure you check out my opponent, link in the description, blah. Bye! Alright guys, today's question of the day, since Manaphy became um, OU from Uber, um, I thought it would be an interesting question of the day, is what current Uber do you think um, you would like to see move back to OU? I'm sure most of you will say Garchomp, but I'm going to be a little different and say Latios. Um, sure, he has an amazing special attack, and he has a great move pool. Um, however, I think it can be safely uh, moved down to OU with the Soul Dew Claws intact. Um, I don't think it would cause too much damage to the metagame. And if you bring Latios back, you might be able to bring back Garchomp, too, since Latios is pretty much a perfect counter to Garchomp. Um, but... I don't know, then we'll have a metagame even more infested with dragons. I don't know. But um, leave a comment about an Uber you would like to see move down to OU. Or if you don't like that question, um, answer what um, OU we'd like to see moved up to Uber. Um, as for me and that question, I would say... Uh, Blissey. Just because I hate it. Alright, peace guys.